Rust Arrow here, TV, welcome. Check it out. We're almost up here to Page, Arizona. Yay! We're gonna see if that uh, horseshoe bend in the Colorado River. It's a scenic view. I think they got a facility there run by the feds. National Parks, I believe. Where they did. I never did stop. I drove past it. Once again, there's one thing. It, one of them days I'm going to stop. Well, guess what? We'll stop today. Yay! So far, 89's been really good to us since we left Flagstaff. Seen the two different national monuments, the Indian ruins and the Sunset Crater. How about that Grand Ca Canyon Vista view going up 89? Who knew about that, huh? That was spectacular. Just the mountains alone. Driving around uh, from Cameron all the way up through that Grand Canyon uh, Vista view. That was a pretty, pretty ride. That was about 40-some miles long, I guess. Somewhere around there, 40, 50. All right. We're getting down through it. We're dropping down. We're coming down in elevation a little bit, but what a pretty ride. Enjoy the views. I'll let the cameras roll. I see a little tiny bit of water. That's probably Lake Powell up there. So we're getting closer and closer. barren land. It's amazing you go from mountains to flat, desert, back to mountains. Kind of gave up on our shotgun cam. I don't care for the view out of the thing. It picks up too much of the dash. So we'll have to figure out something else. So I'm just going to do the handheld for side views and then our regular old dash mount. Billboards. Must be getting close to town. Yeah, I can definitely see water way out. That is Lake Powell. And it's heating up. Temperature on the dash says 100 even. On the thermometer on the van.
page itself, I probably won't do much around the town for filming because most everything is shut down, especially here on the Navajo Nations. Uh, uh, Native Americans have really been hit hard with the virus, so a lot of their museums and visitor centers are closed. But hopefully, and here it is, here I think. Yep, yay. I see cars, it's open. Here's that Horseshoe Bend Park. Let's check it out. Yeah, there's quite a few cars there. Boy, there's another rental. I've seen rentals everywhere. That business is booming. Also, the R you can rent your own. There's a place called RV Share. I've seen it online and on TV. If you want to rent your RV. I would never rent my RV to anyone at any time, ever. Could you imagine? Come back all beat up. <laughs> no thanks. Alright, looks like got to pay a fee. Ten bucks. It's worth it. This thing here is probably one of the most photographed picturesque places in the world. You see it in movies and magazines and online pictures. Wow, there's quite a few here. Hey, this one's open. Alright. Let me get checked in. Hi. I'm well. I've been waiting for this for a oh, long good. time. Well, we have a new trail, so it's really nice to walk on. Okay. Um, Oh yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. All right, we're in. Yay. Got to walk down there. It's, they said new trails and take drinking water. You betcha. It's hot. Really not the best time of day to be doing this, but... Okay, we're here. I'm gonna do it. Alright, well, let me find a place to park. And we'll get walking. Pretty blue sky. The winds even died down. It's the temperature in the van was 101 when I turned it off. But I got plenty of water with me, camera batteries, handheld camera, and cell phone. We'll just take our time and go down there and check this thing out. Too bad don't have that ATV going. There are private tours that you can hire in Page itself. You can actually go on the Colorado River by raft, boat. They'll bring you down here. Private tours that'll bring you out in Jeeps. 
Trouble is, most of that shut down are extremely restricted. Boy, ten bucks a whack. And them cars are just, you know, a thousand cars, that's ten thousand dollars a day. That ought to help keep the maintenance up on this one. All right, looks like a long walk. It is hot, hot, hot. And this is all downhill now. Coming back's going to be brutal. Oh well. It's got to be worth it. There you go, that lady there. Got her little electric cart. We're almost there. Here it is up here. Looks like they got some overlook areas. That was another good idea. Have an umbrella for shade. But I've seen people with some dogs down here and their poor doggy paws are getting pretty burned up. Selfies everywhere. Check it out. <laughs> I like that fence. That's a lot of logs. Log fence all over. Well, let's go up this overlook first check it out. I've been wanting to do this forever. Come see this in person. Alright, you guys ready? Here it is. Horseshoe Bend in the Colorado River. Wow, look at that. That is way down there. That's a couple thousand feet down. There's boats down there, look like tiny dots. Look at all the green algae in there. And it's shaped like a horseshoe. Whew. That's something. Well, it's definitely worth 10 bucks to come down there and see this thing. This wasn't so hot. Definitely worth it. If you get a chance, get down there, bring your hiking boots, bring water. Bring an electric uh, cart. <laughs> Let's go over to Selfie Rock over here. See, now that's where them people 
turn around, they fall off. Let me sneak up here. Yeah. Actually, that viewpoint was better. Alrighty, I'm hot. I'm out of here. from Page. We'll head in uh, through town. On the other side of town is that big bridge. Glen Canyon Dam. I think that'd be a good place to do a video, don't you? <laughs> Fun anyway, huh? Alrighty. Almost up to the top here. Thank goodness. Alright, I'm gonna get in that van and let that air conditioner run a while. Drink some water. That's a pretty good hike down there and back. There's a big old check mark off the bucket list. This has been on it for a long, long time. Kind of like last year in that Four Corners. I've been wanting to come here forever. In the heat, I just went slow, drank plenty of water, but it did get warm. Feels good to be in this van. Actually, it kind of tired. All right, well, let's do this. Let's head on into town. Cruise uh, out to that Glen Canyon Dam and see what else we can get into. It's still, we got a little daylight left. Might as well keep on filming. As always, I hope everything's safe in your world. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is the Virtual Vacation Tour 2020 RV or TV. Yay! Alright, talk soon. <laughs>